Godzilla versus Red Ming. Uh, this is something I didn't think I'd ever see. I mean, we've got a turning red character, aka a giant red panda, versus Godzilla, who we all know on this channel. He is ultra powerful. Now, if you have seen the turning red movie, one, let me know in the comments, but two, you know that Red Ming, she is very powerful. I mean, she is literally a giant red panda, maybe even the same size as Godzilla. But she did end up getting beat up by her own daughter, who was literally not even close to her size. Who do you have in this fight? By the way, we also have Godzilla versus Tentacular or Tentacular killer in the next video. I don't know what that means. But here we go with the first one. Godzilla versus Turning Red. Who do you think is going to win? Both of these videos are by UG, by the way. He'll be in the description if you want to check him out after. The next video, we got Tentacular versus Godzilla. But this one, let's see what Red Ming's got in her bag. Uh, now, as you can see, we can see the size difference, a very large size difference. I don't think that's Red Ming. I think that's the daughter, right? Which I totally forgot her name. I don't know why. I just watched the movie anyways. That's the smaller version of the Red Panda. So I don't think they're going to fight. That would not be a very good fight. He could just... Don't eat her. Please don't eat. I forgot her name. Okay, really, Godzilla? Why you gotta yell at her? You know what I'm saying? Look how terrified the red panda looks. And I mean, honestly, I can't blame him. I would be peeing my pants right now. I ain't gonna lie to you. If Godzilla picked you up and screamed in your face, come on. That would be it. Why is she throwing her arms up? Oh, okay. Well, that's nice, Godzilla. <laughs> but that's Red Ming. That's who I was talking about. And hold up now, look at the size comparison already. This is like I was saying, they are pretty much the same size. And look at the baby. Well, not the baby. It's just the daughter of Red Ming. Not very tall and not very powerful. Let's see what happens. Okay, at least she caught her daughter. I was about to say, Godzilla wasn't going to eat him or anything. He even pet the, the, the red panda. So I don't know why she was so mad. And you know what? I'm going for Godzilla. I mean, come on, you can't pick Red Ming, right? Unless you did, hey. I don't blame you. Well, I kind of do, but whatever. That's disrespectful. You know, usually they throw each other through buildings. She done took a piece of a building and threw it at Godzilla. That's disrespectful. <gasps> okay, Godzilla said, okay, you're going to throw a piece of a building. I'm going to take half of a whole building and throw it at you. I like where Godzilla's coming from. Was that a drop kick? I have never seen a Godzilla dropkick before. That was sick. Ooh, that roar. You can feel it in your soul. What was up? I've never heard a Red Ming roar. Oh my goodness, she done brought up the Red Moon. Does that like power her up or something? You ain't gonna get past an atomic breath though. Wow. Why'd he only shoot a little beam? You should have kept going. Unless it's easy as that. What'd I tell you? I told you the Godzilla. Oh! Okay, that's the end of this video, but he didn't have to step on the little one. Now, this video right here is tentacular or tentacular. I don't know. Let me know how to say that in the comments. But now he is fighting Godzilla. Who do you got in this video? I still have Godzilla. I mean, he ended that very fast in last video. But this one, isn't he from Rumble? I saw, like, previews and stuff, but I've never seen the actual, like... Is it a movie? I've never seen it. I don't know. Let me know if you've seen it in the comments. Maybe you know how powerful this character is. I'm still going Godzilla regardless. There's no way, right? Maybe, though, because he is like a boxer or something, right? So maybe he's super powerful. I don't know. But it's Godzilla. Come on now. There ain't no way. I mean, look at his entrance. Maybe not. Oh, there he goes. He said forget stepping over the... What are those called? Turnbuckles? <laughs> I forgot what it's called. The ropes. We're calling them ropes. Oh, my goodness. Okay. We're going to call him Tint, by the way. I don't like saying his full name. Actually, we're calling him T. We got T and we got G. Did that already hurt him? Oh. Okay, I, I don't know what that was. Just hit him with the atomic breath. Ugh, I don't like that face he's got. Why was he doing that? 
This this is gonna be fast, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you that right now. This is gonna be a fast one. Unless my boy T pulls out something crazy. Oh, he's charging at him. Come on, G. Kiss him death. Go ahead and hit him with it. Never mind, he's getting up. You wait. Okay. Here we go with the atomic ah! weapon. That's the end of this video. We clearly saw who won. It would be Godzilla. He did not have to do that to a man. Off to our third video, though. This is a little bonus video. This is called Micro Godzilla by Shutter Authority, who will also be in the description. Well, let's see what we got here. What is Low that? Low battery warning. Low battery? Low battery warning. What does that mean? Oh, it's going to shrink him down? Low Imagine seeing warning. a Godzilla the same size as you. Would you be scared still? I mean, I probably would. It's like a giant crocodile. But if he's that size, I'm not going to be too scared. He's the size of an ant? Wow. Maybe he's a little bigger than an ant, though. I need to see him, like, side by side. Oh, he's totally the same size as an ant. You wouldn't even see him. You'd be stepping. Maybe he's out there. Godzilla could be out there right now, but maybe he's just tiny. He's Antzilla. What is he about to do with this butterfly? Ah, he was trying to be nice too. That's probably what's going to make him angry. Oh, that bug was changing colors. What was that thing? Dang, the ants might be a little bigger than him actually. I think that ant helped him, by the way. He, like, lifted the stick for him. I have never seen Godzilla this small before. It's funny. In at the roar at the salamander. What was that? Exactly like I said. You could be just walking. <laughs> There's Godzilla right under you. You never know. What in the world? <laughs> Imagine having a pet Godzilla. Oh! He went even smaller? So now he's definitely smaller than an ant. You'd never see him at this point. No way. Okay, now it's a definite. A few moments later... Where is he? Oh, he's that tiny now? You would never see Godzilla again. That would be it. I don't even know where he is. What is that thing? That's that's pretty gross. Oh, he didn't have to kick it like that. Uh, Godzilla, you shouldn't have done that, man. Oh, okay. It was just a dream. Everybody, we're all, even though Godzilla is still like the size of a human, and he's got an apartment. What in the world? What is? That's the end of this video. Um, I, I never want to see that type of ant. I don't know what type of ant that would even be. Like a giant ant. Uh, leave that in the video. Other than that, thank you guys for watching with me. I will see you all tomorrow. I love ya. Goodbye.